Hey, Scott Austin here. In this video, I'm going to show you the visualization tool that we're providing you so that you can look at the different types of abyss towels and colors and look at different combinations and decide how they're going to work in your bathroom. So I'm going to click on the Get Started button, and it's going to load up what we call the configurator. And it does take a moment to load this, as there's a lot of content and data behind the scenes. And what we'll be able to do is we'll be able to walk through step by step, product by product, and select what towels we want, in what sizes, and in what colors and quantities, and put that all together. And while we're doing that, we can see what it looks like. So here on bath sheets, I have the choice between two bath sheet sizes. I can select one or the other, or I can actually select both. And when I select the size, the color picker pops up and I can pick what color I want to look at. So let's pick the aqua and you can see what it looks like in this visualization of a bathroom over here. And I can also change the quantity. And as I change the quantity, the price will be updated. So I can see what my total cart size is going to be as I'm adding more products to my design. Once I'm happy with my bath sheet selection, I can go on and click next and it'll take me to bath towels or I could have clicked bath towels at the top. You can click the tab at the top or the next button at the bottom and they both work. Now bath towels only come in one size so I can select the color I want there and I can see what that looks like on here and if I don't like how that matches or doesn't match the bath sheet, I can change that choice until I get to something that I do like and then I can also change the quantity and click that next button to go on to the next thing, which is hand towels. There's two sizes of hand towels, fingertip and regular. I can pick one, the other, or both. Now, if you happen to pick both and choose a color, you'll see it show up here. Um, we don't have in our visualization showing both colors at the same time, and the top one is the one that shows up here, as you can see. But I can change my quantities move them up or down as desired. I can see how the price updates from those choices. Go on to next. And now I'm looking at washcloths, which only come in one size. I can select a color. And if I don't like the choice or decide I don't want washcloths, I can always go back and check none and remove that from my order. In this case here, I'm gonna hit the apple green one. And I'm just gonna say I just want one of those. Move on to the next choice, which is bath mats. Uh, we have two sizes of bath mats. Pick the one that I prefer, or once again, you can pick both. Pick the color, see how that fits in with the rest of your design. Now, obviously, I'm not color coordinating my choices here. I'm just picking random colors at this time. But you can use this to visualize and see what these different colors look like next to each other. When I'm happy with my choice, I can go on to the next and last choice, which is bath rugs. Now, bath rugs come with non-slip backing and with standard canvas backing. The non-slip backing is what most people choose. People with heated floors tend to choose the standard canvas backing. And there's five different sizes for bath rugs. And you can pick all 10 of those combinations if you want, pick colors for each of them, or you can just pick one. In this case here, I'm gonna pick a large non-slip backing, pick a color, see what that looks like. Now, if I'm happy with my order, I can click the next button It'll take me to my summary tab and I can look at all my choices and say if I like them or not. In this case, if I want to, I can go back and say, well, on bath rugs, I want to go with a more traditional uh, ivory color. And maybe on my bath mats, bath mats, I want to change my color also. So you can go back at any time. You don't have to just go forward. You can go back in your choices and change them as you're doing things. And I go back to that summary tab, see what my choices look like, see what the total cost is going to be. And if I'm happy with my choices, I can add that to the cart. And then it's going to add all those different products to your cart in the quantities that you selected. And as you can see, it does take a moment for that to happen. But now here I am in the cart and all the quantities that I chose, all the products that I chose, and all the colors and sizes that I chose are now there. You can continue on your shopping experience or you can check out. All right. Thanks for watching.